two, one, go. Team 75-15 scoring a couple of cargo for the Blue Alliance. Human player on the Blue Alliance tried to deliver a piece of cargo. Looks like it was just outside. Two shots in the upper hub for Red from Team 26-14 out of Morgantown, West Virginia. Technical difficulties, facing a little bit of difficulties against the Red Alliance defense, Team 72-74, trying to stop that finely tuned machine from picking up cargo for the Blue Alliance. Meanwhile, the Red Alliance partner, 26-14, Continuing to score some cargo for Red. Team 4050 Biohazard, their robot RoboPet, now lining up to the lower hub and scoring via their very unique shoot mechanism. Team 2614. Joining their alliance partner over on the blue side of the field. They're going to pick up a few more pieces of cargo and lob them right into the upper hub for a total of two points for each score. About a minute left on the clock for qualification match number 14. Team 4085, despite the defense from the Red Alliance, continuing to move about the field, trying to pick up as much piece of cargo as they can. Their Alliance partners from Parkersburg, West Virginia, Team 7515 on the far side of the field, is in possession of a piece of cargo, but they're facing some of that tough Red Alliance defense as we head into the last 30 seconds of the match. Blue Alliance with both of their robots in the hangar zone. They're extending their hooks. They are looking to take off here pretty soon. 10 seconds left to go in the match. Red Alliance will find Team 2614, Mountaineer Area Robotics on Mars. Up on the mid rung, their alliance partner, Biohazard, trying to join right next to them as the buzzer hits. Got to get a grip. The score 56 to 10. Red Alliance scoring a cargo bonus for scoring more than 20 cargo during that qualification match. Up next, match number 15.